Hello everyone. We had to show you Hazel's beautiful outfit today. She has these adorable, I already put her poncho on. You guys, one of our followers sent this to Hazy. She's been wearing it a lot lately because it keeps her warm and she doesn't have to put it through a sleeve and stretch out a shirt. Only a few days left of this cast and she can start wearing normal stuff, although this poncho is so adorable. Okay, let's show them your overalls. She has some little floral overalls on and they're so cute. They're like just cute little flowers and a cute little white shirt and her poncho. I love you. I'm gonna take the morning and get laundry done, clean up, run to the grocery store and get some stuff done. So I'm kind of excited actually. And you guys, I also have several orders to fill. So I'm gonna be doing those for you guys today. What up you guys? We are up American Fork Canyon, one of our favorite canyons in the entire world, you guys. We are up here because on our fall bucket list is to check out the changing leaves, the colorful changing leaves. Check this out, you guys. We are at just the right time. Look at all of these different colors. Look at this. Whoa, it's gorgeous. I, I like the orange ones and the yellow ones. Yeah, orange is like gotta be my favorite. Favorite. Because there's like a lot of yellow out here, but it's not as much. Although we just pulled off at a spot where there's quite a bit of orange. But right now you've got all the different colors. You've got the green, you've got the yellow, you've got the orange. And so we wanted to come up. Now this doesn't count as being checked off our bucket list because we're going to do this as an entire family. Just me and Brex out here today. We're just chilling in the afternoon together. Oh, <laughs> but the reason I wanted to come up is because I wanted to send the drone out and get some drone footage of these leaves as they're changing colors and just get the scenic beauty, take it all in. And also guys, this might be the last flight I have with this drone. That's a little foreshadowing to what may happen later in the vlog. I'm not positive, but if things go according to plan today, we might be adding a new member to the Bingham family by the end of the vlog today. So stick around for that, but sending out the Mavic Air for potentially its last flight as a Bingham here in American Fort Canyon to capture these beautiful fall leaves. bucket list time. Who's ready to check something off on our fall bucket Ooh, list? Baby, baby. Huh? So guys, here's the deal. We'd already talked about this. We were gonna do corn bellies today. So we have on here, go to corn bellies. That was one that we were super stoked on. It's a lot of fun outdoor activities. Here's the problem though. It started pouring rain, like pouring rain. Even though it's not raining now, that turns that place kind of muddy. So mom has come up with an insane backup plan. Tell me what you guys wanna do on this list. Uh, dip caramel apples. The kids have universally decided while they're doing homework that they wanna dip caramel apples. But you know what? Mom doesn't just dip caramel apples, guys. She's gotta do it Bingham, which means, I shouldn't say Bingham. This is very Mindy Bingham. It means hyper organized fully themed and totally epic. So mom has gone and got a Halloween tablecloth. She's got apples, which are the wrong color, but that's okay. She's got apples. We've got toppings. We've got Oreos. We've got Butterfinger. We've got Reese's Pieces. And what Bingham Halloween party or caramel apple for that matter would be complete without rainbow sprinkles. <laughs> We're going to have an epic, fun-filled family night here in the house because it's bad weather outside, it's raining, it's storming, the old man is snoring, and so we're gonna be making some caramel apples here as a family, and we're gonna be rolling them in these delicious goodies, and they're gonna be chomping on them, maybe watching a fun Halloween movie Rag I wants to. Oh, by the way, you guys, I asked for some suggestions on Halloween movies, and we got like a ton of Halloween Town suggestions, right, yeah. Halloween Town? Yeah. Guys, but I'm 40 for years official, old, I've never heard of that. For our official Halloween movie night, I have a little special something up my face. Oh, we don't even know about this, guys. This so is a late-breaking surprise. Not. We're gonna be doing that tonight. We're gonna be doing that another night. Official night. bucket list Halloween movie night will be reserved on a different night with a different movie. But tonight, I kind of want to find this Halloween town that everyone's talking about. Everyone is saying you've got to watch Halloween Town. I'm gonna check that out. I think it's a fun one with the family. Can't wait to add that to our October list of fun things that we do. Hey, you go, will you stop touching that? <laughs> <laughs> Hazy, you're too adorable for your own good. She's sitting over here like pulling on the tablecloth, almost pulling the condiments down to the ground. And I'm like, stop it. Stop it. And she goes, 
<laughs> and I just she just sits there. I, I just turned and just started laughing. Every single one of us in the right kitchen. Her. And started laughing. I was like, oh, has wow. to turn away because she's too adorable for us to do a serious face for any amount of time. So we all started laughing. But it's no laughing matter. It's caramel apple night, guys. It's time to party. Mom, what are we doing over here, by the way? Because we are learning how to make caramel apples. I've spent my entire life stirring caramels. So we're actually have never done this before. So I wouldn't say necessarily follow I our caramel apple one recipe. Other time and I realized this is brutally a lot tortured. of work. So I can take this over in a minute, but like once it's all smoothed out. But what, <laughs> but what you're supposed to do is you take caramels, you add a little bit of water into it, and then you have to stir, it says, constantly. Somebody get me a bar stool. I'm until it's everyone. smooth. This could be a little bit of stirring, but once that's done, we're gonna dip but the apples. I got apple cider. Guys, mom got apple cider to go along with in this. In what Brandon called the cauldron. Yeah, it's boiling in the cauldron right now. The witch is stirring it. Oh! Oh! Wait, what witch let you buy a drone today? Uh, we'll talk about that later tonight. <laughs> Here, let me stir that a little bit, actually. <laughs> Whatever, you just wanted to show off your muscles in the video. I don't really have that many these days. <laughs> you only have a nine pack. <laughs> a nine oh pack? My gosh, I love you. <laughs> Poor Brexy is sitting here. He doesn't like his chili. He is trying so hard. Crew, do you want to tell him what you did to eat your chili? I hey, thought that it was so delicious, super good, even though it was disgusting and it just got me through. <laughs> and it just got me through. <laughs> what is Rye Guy's trick? Rye Guy, what was, what was, Rye your, guy, trick? What was your trick? I just ate it because it was good. Yes. See, there you go. There we go. Mine was totally better. <laughs> High five, guys. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? You don't even know what's going on. <laughs> How's this looking, Mom? Oh, it's starting to look like caramel. Good job. It's actually getting down there. But what's like the next step? Do you have to immediately like start dipping? Or how I don't know. Work? Where's the? What did you do with the bag? Uh, I don't know. Ah, I find oh, it. One thing to know about Brandon, you guys, he leaves stuff everywhere. I'm sorry, this writing is so small, I cannot I can read it. So we're just making this up as we go. We want to have something over here at the table that we can dip it in, but not a hot pan. So we're dipping it, we're throwing it into here, put it on low heat so it stays melted, and then we're gonna dip the apples in this, and then come over here and put it on. But we don't really know if like you do that immediately, or if you wait a couple minutes, or... Comment down below. Yeah. I should have done chocolate. No! Oh, like with it? To drizzle. Drizzle, yeah. Oh well. You can do that after. Pretty much rainbow sprinkles, and that's about it. Mom's got some wax paper over here to set the apples on, and she even sprayed it, so we're definitely not gonna stick. What the bag said. Okay, well, we're following the bag instructions right now. First step, take off these things. Yeah, you don't wanna eat that or cover it in caramel, I and then. washed them off already. Okay, they're washed. Now we're gonna stick the sticks in. Love it. Do you guys wanna stick your own apples? Do you want mom to stick them, and then you just dip them? <laughs> stick them and dip them, people. Stick them and dip them. <laughs> you can get a stick. Hey, show me your whiny face again. What does that look like when you want your own? <laughs> okay, that was perfect. That was exactly what I was expecting. Okay, Hazy Girl has got her out. Oh, okay. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> hey, these are... <laughs> <laughs> These are DIY people. You can do this any way you yeah. want. <laughs> and that's how AC does it. Now, more traditionally, you stick it through the core there. Ow, that's the <laughs> right. I'll show you guys what we're gonna do. Alright, so mom's gonna make this up. Here we go. How do we do? <laughs> I don't know what kind I want. We go like this. I don't want. The most important thing is determining what kind you want. Now, I kind of want like a cinnamon sugar. We have a place here called Rocky on Chocolate Factory that makes what they call an apple pie caramel apple. And they have like a white chocolate something around it. So it's not gonna be quite the same, but I do want to try some cinnamon sugar rolled around in that, but then like obviously. Hazel's fell out, so I shall- Oh, I'm shocked. Hazel's fell out. Okay. I think I'm gonna go with sprinkles. Oh, mom's starting us off strong with the rainbow sprinkles. Rexy Dool, what do you think you're gonna do in yours, buddy? Hard to say. Rainbow sprinkles? Okay. I love it, dude. Cinnamon and rainbow sprinkles. How do you make it stick to the apple? I feel like every time we've done this, it like just falls off the apple. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh my gosh, that looks delicious. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, oh. wow. You guys, this is Caramel Apple Perfection. That's the cover of a magazine right there. I know, honey. Caramel Apple Weekly. I love that magazine. It's actually quarterly. And then you pull it out with a little, and it says to scrape off the bottom. Should we get like a stick or a knife to just swipe off the bottom? I hope you do a spoon, because then you get to lick it next. Okay, I'm a big fan of that. Now set it down so that it, does, then it, does it kind of just like fall down to the bottom? I'm just gonna like. It's holding really well right now. I'm actually very impressed with this. Oh, oh, oh. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. 
If there was a caramel apple named the Bingham, it would look like try. this. It's doing it. It's doing it. It's doing it. How do you keep it from doing that, guys? If you know, please comment That's below. What I'm gonna do. It's not gonna help us for tonight. But how do you keep it from just like eventually sliding its way down and onto this paper? That looks so like stinking this. good. You know who I wish was here to sample this? Maddie. Maddie. This is so Maddie. It's not even funny, you guys. Let's Maddie, send her one. We'll Maddie. send her one. You know what? I'll bring her one home because I would bring her a dessert. You know what? Oh. Oh. Let us know if you understand that reference. Okay, here we go. I don't get it. That looks amazing, hey, Mom. All right, next up is Kirby Doo. We're gonna have mom handle the dipping because honestly, like, first of all, she is the Our biggest dip in the family. Coverage. And then also, yeah, she is probably the and best. And these apples are so baby. They're so baby. <laughs> <laughs> but mom is like really good at getting it fully engrossed in caramel and then smoothing out the layers. She knows her way around a caramel apple. Kirby Doo, what are you going with? What's your topping, bro? Um, I actually really want the Oreos half Oreo, half sprinkle. Oh my gosh, I love I where your head's at, dude. Set up, just, set up just a little bit. Just a little bit. Hey, then we're gonna let Kirby Doo dip, right? All right, you little savage. Half and half. I think if you just do like boom and then boom. I have a feeling this is Mom, like you gotta do not it. really. You gotta do it while it's on there, okay. Okay, that's and good. And then up and over. They go drop it. You're good. It's okay. It's gonna get mixed up. You do you want to do the other sides? Right there. Yeah. Get those layers, baby. Get every nook and cranny of caramel covered in delicious coatings of toppings. Wow, dude. This looks so good, bro. I love it. Kind of like a head. Like this is the hair. Yeah, okay. I mean, sure. And the rainbow sprinkles are on the face. I love it. I got a rainbow okay. sprinkle. So let's just see how this goes. Set this on there. Mom's in the fridge is holding up very nicely. I think the cooling of it kept it from sliding down the sides. We may be doing that. We just don't have a lot of refrigerator space right now. I say at the end of this, we have our YouTube family vote on which one they think was the best caramel apple. Cause right now, like it's hard for me to say. Cause that one covered in sprinkles is so amazing. But then this half and half, bro. I mean, that's next level, dude. Where do you see a half and half like that? You can't get that anywhere besides the Bingham kitchen. That's a crew special. Mom mouth. <laughs> All right guys, up next, he's got his Butterfinger ready to go. It looks like Rye Guy's gonna go Butterfinger. That's a Bingham classic since the 1980s. It is my favorite. Oh, let's wait for it to cool just a smidge. That looks so nice. Guys, you're gonna be caramel apple professionals. And by the way, these guys accidentally matched today. They all wore oh, the exact heart. same school uniform today. <gasps> oh, me too. Don't jump, Rexy. Right? <laughs> you're good. <laughs> okay, here comes Rag Eye in the dip. Butterfinger time. Butterfinger, butterfinger, butterfinger. There's a spoon, so if you want to. You can kind of spoon up and put it on the top so the areas that it doesn't get. So don't spin, Rag Eye, because it yeah, will pull the caramel off. off. The caramel. So you just like, you dab, pick it up, turn around, dab. Yeah. You know the dab, right? The dab. <laughs> Oh my okay. gosh, dude. That looks like you could sell that at Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory right now. Okay, that is so that. good. Butterfinger apple is a little bit heavier. We're getting that one in the fridge. Next up is Brexy. Brex, are you next, bro? No, me, me, me. Hazy didn't eat any of her dinner, so she's not supposed to have her caramel apple, but she's being really cute. Mm -hmm. I think Hazy go first. <laughs> well, 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 Brexy doodle. <laughs> what do you say to Brex? Thank you, thank you. Let's get Hazy over here with her what one arm. Dip Don't fall. Yeah, No Oreos, okay, no. no Oreos. No Oreos, just caramel and sprinkles. Okay, here we go. Hazy's up. <laughs> Hazy, the tablecloth matches your cast. Hazy wants to do mom style. Mom style? Yeah, that makes sense, actually. Hazy's gonna dip her own. It's really heavy, sweetie. And then now we're pick gonna it up turn it. And turn it, there you go. Yeah. We and did the mash. Pick it up we did the rainbow sprinkle it. mash. Hazy girl, you know how to do it. You know oh how to do gosh, it. Oh my gosh, Hazy. Hazy, what do you think of it? You guys, I think it's this one. Hazy girl, you got your plate? <laughs> Hey, what do you think of that apple? That's your apple. I don't know. <laughs> Let's get it cooled off. Put it in the fridge for a minute, okay? And then when it's a, oh, that's right. It's Brexy's turn. The gentleman who let Hazy take his turn. Now he's up. Thank you. This is a great one for me. Thank you so much. I give you the bigger one than anybody. You're such a stud, dude. Okay, what does my Brexy want? Sprinkles. Sprinkles? Oh, whatever, Dad. Oh, Dad. Here goes Brexy Doodle. Yours is good, Hazy. Go. Here goes Brexy Doodle. Oh, dude, yes. You just want to get like mostly sprinkles Do you want covered. it all over the whole thing? Sure. Leave that top layer, Mom, and okay. then let's sprinkle on top of that. It's a great idea. Ooh. I don't think it's sticking at all. No, none tricky. of it's sticking. Mom's has come out of the refrigerator. For the most part, it's held together. Brexus is going in. I'm about to dip mine, guys. You're going to see something you've never seen before. I put my hand up on a hip. When, when I, I dip, you dip, we dip. That's the song. Kirby Doo has retrieved his from the refrigerator. Wait, wait, I'll cut it for you. Looking like perfection. Set it down so you don't yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's set them up in a row and then we'll have everybody vote on their favorite one. Alright, Dad. Dad, what are you gonna do with these two? How did you get it? I tipped it, that's why I asked if you wanted me to do you it. You tipped the pot or mm -hmm. the Nope, touch the bottom thing. It's hot right there. 
Dad is learning you have to kind of tip it to get it fully covered in caramel. Just gotta wait for it to, uh, yep, there you go. You wanna tip it towards the bottom, not the top of your hand. Oh, okay. Yep. Well, look, I have a cool, like, If you hold dynamic. it straight up and down, it will all even out. I probably should dip it now because the caramel's okay, getting kind of Okay, three, two, one, you ready, cool. Mom? Send it, here we go. Choosh, choosh, Oh. choosh. choosh. Okay, Ooh, now, that immediately looks... over here. Oh boy. Give me <gasps> the world. I want the world in an apple. It's dripping all over the place. I'm losing it, I'm losing it. Okay, turn it upside down. Okay. Wow, yeah. Yeah? Huh? Nobody's voting for mine. <laughs> no. I know. I'm up, I'm up. Yes. All the kids unanimously raise their hands. Mine's just like the ugliest, but I think it might be. <laughs> wow. I think it might be a tasty combination. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, I think it's gonna be really good. <laughs> You can see sarcasm in a voice. So you kind of just have to hold, you're hanging it over the caramel and that. getting sprinkles all over the caramel. How'd you make the caramel that much better? When I asked if I should dip it for you. Probably should have said yes. <laughs> hold it all different directions, that way it doesn't pour everywhere. Look how I got tip it to the side, right tip it to the other side, so it kind of is all even. Thank you. Look at that. All right guys, I'm pretty stoked on it, I'm not gonna lie. We're gonna put it in here. I think I put too much caramel on because it's really heavy and it's like settling down, but I'll put it in there, check on that in a minute. That might be the best apple ever made, we'll see. Apparently there's a caramel apple dance, none of us were aware of but is making me freak out that you're going to get caramel somewhere <laughs> so this one is we're making for the neighbors now we had a couple extra so we're gonna make it for our neighbors i am getting sugar everywhere this one we call it a grumpy apple this one's a grumpy apple he's a little bit wankly <laughs> i want some more <laughs> Last apple of the night. We're gonna make this one for a neighbor. We haven't used the Reese's pieces yet, which I'm shocked because I actually was the one who asked you to pick those up. And I didn't know you'd throw rainbow sprinkles in the mix. And how do you say no to that? So we're gonna do Reese's pieces for the neighbors here. Now yeah, that's classic. That is, oh my gosh, look at that. Why are we so good at this? Well, I don't know that we are. I definitely don't know that we are. But I just feel like when you make it at home, you can make it how you want it. Like if you go and get it somewhere, it may not be as loaded as we load it here because they got to worry about anywhere will ever be as loaded as you load it. <laughs> 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 oh my gosh, what is that? <laughs> Everyone has taken their position by their apple. And we want you guys to comment below who had the best apple. Let me show you each one, just as a refresher as to who did what. If you guys have a name for your apple, you can go ahead and throw out the name. This is Rye Guy's apple. He covered it in Butterfinger. It actually looks pretty good and held up pretty well considering the weight. Rye Guy, what do you think of your apple? Peanut butter dominator. Peanut butter dominator, guys. Who thinks peanut butter dominator? Mm -hmm. I like that. Okay, now mom was the original apple dipper and coder. Hers was doing really, really well. It seems to have <laughs> sunk to the bottom. But you were like, you know, the first piece is always the sacrifice. You were the first one. I was the sacrifice. I think it's honestly amazing. Who thinks mom's is the best? Comment below. Mine is named Lady Sprinkles. Lady Sprinkles? Ooh, I like it. It's like Lady Sparkles with Lady Sprinkles from I Trolls. Know, like I like it. that. Hazy girl, her apple is as precious as she is. What's and it, yours named? Do you have a name for your apple? Sparkles. Sparkles is Lady Sparkles. Oh, how original. Okay, I love you. Brexy Doodle had a combination of cinnamon sugar with sprinkles. However, it seems to have slid off the side and the cinnamon sugar did not stick very well. We learned a lesson with Brexy's, but it's gonna be delicious, dude. Do you have a name for yours? Uh, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. I like it. And in fact, that's a great song from Armin Van Buren. So now we have Kruby Doo who went with the half and half, you guys. The Two Face, if you will. In fact, that could be the name of your Two Face, but you don't have to. So here we go. We've got Oreo on one side, Rainbow Sprinkles on the other. Pretty savage. Do you have a name for yours, bro? Um, the Rainbow. Shredder. The Rainbow Shredder? Oh my gosh, you guys. Who thinks the Rainbow Shredder? Definitely got one of the coolest names. But I love that, the Rainbow Shredder. And then, of course, we have, I don't know, the best apple ever made in the history of apples. Cinnamon sugar coated, followed by an attempt to cover it in rainbow sprinkles. As you can see, at this point, pretty much most of the rainbow sprinkles have fallen off and fallen on the bottom. Guys, this one is the sugar, spice, and everything nice apple because it's got the cinnamon for the spice. It's got sugar like you wouldn't believe. Oh, and it comes with apple cider. Pretty much mine is just pure heaven. Comment below, you guys, who made the best apple? And you won't hurt any of our feelings because we all pretty much love our own apple. This was a ton of fun, Mom. Nice job. Yeah, this was way fun. I'm glad that we decided to do this night. I'm kind of glad that Corn Billy's tanked and we were able to do this fun activity. Because we're still going to get to do it. It's still on our list. But it's still on our list. We're still going to be knocking things off, guys. But tonight we knocked off off of our fall bucket list, making caramel apples as a family, and having a great time. We are now finishing up eating these caramel apples. Finishing or finished. 
I could only eat like one piece of mine. This was super fun. We checked something off the bucket list. Hey, huge shout out and props and a massive thumbs up on this video for mom because well, you threw this together in a last minute pinch because corn bellies fell. Well, and so we went with this and it was fun. Like, it, it was, was a way full fun. night of fun. It Thank was you, way mom. fun. I was just thinking about that the afternoon. Like, September is a hard month to vlog because there's nothing going on. With October, November, December, we we're running into some super fun months. We, we have some, some fun super stuff. fun stuff planned. Guys, speaking of some big stuff going on. Oh. There's a new member of the family. Now, I know that not everybody here is as big of a tech nerd as me, so I'm not gonna do a big full review and unboxing and all that other stuff, because you guys will probably barely even notice the difference. You'll just know that there's some sick aerial footage, but we have the latest and greatest DJI Mavic Zoom, Mavic 2 Zoom or something like that. Anyways, it's unreal. There are some cool features in it. We're gonna test them out, play with it. I just got it today. I haven't even opened it. It's literally sitting here waiting to be opened. I'm gonna set it up tonight, and there'll be much more to come from this bad boy. And he'll bring you some awesome drone footage. So the drone footage you guys saw in today's video was not from this. That was the last that was not from this one. So tomorrow, yeah, maybe you'll get some new oh, stuff. Oh, I actually forgot I mentioned that I may be getting a new member of the family before the end of the day. I did. <laughs> he did. Then also, coming up tomorrow, we have something tomorrow. Parent-teacher conferences for these kids. And then Friday, right? Friday is huge, you guys. Friday, do you want to tell them what we have? I'm swimming. Swimming. You guys, he is swimming his very first 100. He's super He's nervous. He's never 100. Do it. He started out 25, so he moved to 50s. And guys, I'll tell you, I've seen him get a little bit tired in the 50s, but if they do the long course, he just has to go there and back. It's a 50 each way. So he's gonna be doing 100 for the first time on his Friday swimming. So you guys, wish him luck and come back and watch it because we are stoked to see this guy compete. Um, what was I gonna say? You guys. Choose your day. Choose your day. Oh, the gray hats. They're back in stock. Gray hats are back in stock. Gray and white, dad caps. We went ahead and reordered because you guys, the demand has been insane. It's sold out We like get messages instantly. every day. We ordered a bunch more of those. We put them back on the site for pre-sale. So if so you, you don't, if you them. ordered a white and gray hat and you're not receiving them right away, it's because they're making we've right rushed now. the order. They're coming. It's coming. Make sure to check out our website. This is HowieBingham.com. If you want some sick swag, turn around. Oh, that. Like that. You guys are awesome. We wanted to order those within this week of the sale to make sure people could get yes. that. So use fall 20 to get 20% off. We didn't want to like reorder them and have them come in stock after the sale. After ended. The sale. Like, oh, that's, that's nice. kind of lame. So. so that's for you guys. We love you. We love you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Made caramel apples and had a great day. So you guys. And bought a drum. We love you guys. Catch us all tomorrow. We'll see you guys. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 Bye.